beautiful Nuru coin is um, a token developed over ethereum platform that is supposed to support and hand to issues of intra-africa trade uh, generally is uh, the use of blockchain technology why we made the uh, neuro coins because we want to hand to transparent intra-africa trade which comes with speed uh, africa trades with africa is uh, only 11 percent and trades with the world is 66 percent what that means is that uh, in africa if we are not able to sort our problems nobody else will come and sort them and via the use of blockchain which is an amazing technology uh, we are able to handle a lot of problems mm, cryptocurrencies only contribute like 10 to 15 percent of the whole technology and many people are misinformed thinking that uh, and because of people wanting to make money they rush to cryptocurrencies but to me i am focusing on building a blockchain technology and that is why we released a token called neurocoin it's at 10 shillings but only during the ico we have not yet launched the ico which is the crowd cell we have launched what we call um, pre-sell which we target global joint ventures those people are saying that we would want to invest in africa and we are looking at the blockchain those are the people that we have opened to so when is the I ico the initial coin offering which is the crowd cell should begin on on 15th of february up to now, probably we have spent around $150,000. Yes. If you want to get a new coin, you must go to our site and register first. Because we are also doing the KYC to make sure that we are getting uh, the right people investing it. After registering, you participate using Ether or Bitcoin. So you indicate how many coins you want, get your money, buy the Ether. You will find our address for Bitcoin or Ether. Send that. Once you send, we will send you a link for the wallet after the ICO. Simple as that. I would really want a lot of young people to get into this. A single developer, you pay them up to $5,000 per hour. Imagine if we had 12,000 IT people who are jobless developing this technology. Imagine you are getting jobs from all over the world to develop this blockchain technology and per week you are making $5,000. Isn't that a big opportunity? Uh, talk about the upcoming projects from the identity management to land, solving land issues, insurance. There are so many opportunities around this that uh, our generation, if we can open our eyes, we can really utilize this. This is what happens. One, you are not getting a token because first thing you want to make money. You are converting to digital asset for it to be used over our e-commerce platforms that are accepting. It's like, uh, there's no difference between the money that you have in the pocket. It's like asking me, I have a hundred shillings in my pocket. How is it going to make money in my pocket? <laughs> That's it. It, it must, that, that is, is used for several things. When you have a token, which is just like money, you can use it as a medium of exchange or store of value, you are storing money. But as the business and the demand increases, you realize that the token also increases in value. You can buy it at zero ten cents of a dollar, and probably in a year's time or two, it's a dollar. Already, that has increased in value. But you'll get more uh, value if you actually start using the token as a medium of exchange. And, uh, Seeds will always be there, and people don't, are not only conned with the cryptocurrency. Haven't we seen on the news, uh, ladies, their, their, their earrings going? How many times are you conned with your normal money? You find people on the road, and uh, they tell you put a thousand shillings good a bit. So, con, conmanship is the, all over the world. We can only put, uh, we can only be on alert. For example, if someone ha is pretending to be Nurcoin anywhere. It's important to make sure that the, the site where you are, you are in contact with the team that are appearing on the paper, and to make sure that before you give out your money, surely you know very well that you are there. Otherwise, uh, that, uh, people are not just conned on cryptocurrencies. Uh, stealing happens all over the world, and not just one-on-one, -on -one, in governments and uh, in, in, in private sector, yes.